This morning on the countdown to the royal wedding, eight days to go. Obviously, a lot of talk about what Kate will be wearing. Yeah, but the men lucky enough to attend the big event will need to be decked out in their finest as well. NBC special correspondent Ben Fogel is here with details. Ben, good morning. Good morning. I can tell you're both very excited. About I am. This. Absolutely. I, am. I have to. I was in London yesterday. The whole city has been transformed. There's flags flying everywhere. The weather's beautiful. The flowers are out. And as you say, attention now is turning towards what the men will be wearing at the wedding. In fact, this has even got our prime minister embroiled. He's not sure whether or not to wear what we call a morning suit. So I went to Savile Row to find out the history of the morning coat. All eyes may be on the bridal dress, but a traditional English wedding has a special magic ingredient. No, it's not Hugh Grant. A disastrous haircut. It's the suits. Morning suits, as they're called over here. They've always been big at society weddings. And there's no better place to go for one of these romantic-looking outfits than London's Savile Row. For more than 200 years, tailors here have honed their craft to a level that has made Savile Row a brand name for bespoke excellence. Savile Row has survived the change in fashion, and these days you'll find cutting edge alongside tradition. And for those who have the money, but not the time, Charlie from Henry Herbert's will brave the London traffic to bring Savile Row to you. 16, yeah, number 16. Perfect. Just make sure it fits yeah. around here. A lot of customers are looking for what's called an hourglass mm -hmm. effect, um, where it just bends in nicely um, around the waist. You have to feel confident, presumably. Yeah. Big day, wedding? Yeah, big day, very important day. What's the date of the wedding? 9th April. And what's uh, your wife's name? Kate. 